welcome back to my channel. My name's Georgia if you're new here. As you can tell from the title of the video, today I'm going to be organising my dressing table and my makeup area. It is gone completely messy. Oh, I've just spilled tea all over me. Oh, it's a good start to the day, isn't it? When you've got tea all over your legs. Um, so yeah, if you'd like to continue watching, go and get yourself a cup of tea. Don't spill it on yourself. So yeah, if you'd like to see what I get up to, then uh, continue watching. So this is my makeup station here. Um, so I'll just show you what it looks like before. So I've obviously got all my brushes out, I've just washed them. Um, but yeah, this is what it looks like to start with. I'm not going to lie, I'm pretty appalled at myself for that. So this dressing table was actually in my spare bedroom and I've recently changed the rooms about so I've brought it back in and all of this makeup here was actually in a beauty trolley nicely organised so it was actually in that trolley there but I'm going to try and keep that separate with all my beauty bits in um, rather than my makeup kit so yeah I thought let's give it a good organise um, don't mind my tea there that I've just spilt all over myself so I think the best thing to do is just completely empty the drawers out so I'm just going to pop you on a time lapse and empty my drawer so I can see exactly what I've got in there. now so I'll try and show you what I've done so this is absolutely everything out of this drawer um, so it actually goes quite far back um, so yeah you can only see half the drawer when it is a oh it's not quite everything out of the drawer oh two little uh, brushes there so what I've tried to do <laughs> whilst I have um, took it out is I've tried to put them in sections now I don't now I know it doesn't look necessarily like this has been put in sections but I've tried to like put powders here with like concealers um, your foundations and bits and there's glitters here lip bits brushes lipsticks beauty blenders um, yeah so now I'm just gonna wipe out the drawer and show you some little bits I've got to go in here to help organise it. Okay, so one of the first things I've got is this. I ordered this off Amazon. Just get into it a second. Just these things, you've got to be like a wizard to get in there. Oh, finally, so it's this is acrylic makeup organizer and it's got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight compartments. So I've got two of these. I also got a lipstick holder, so I already had one here, but it only held nine lipsticks, so that just wasn't enough. So I've got a bigger one here and this holds 
24 lipsticks. Got that. And then ages ago from, I think it was B&M, I bought this. Now it doesn't look like much. They're like a little acrylic trays again. Um, but they look sort of like they sit next to each other. So I will pop, give them a little clean first, pop them in and give them a clean out and again try and do it all in my sections. So again I'll pop you on another time lapse so you can see what I'm up to. stuck now for ideas of maybe where things can go um so yeah let me just show you where i'm at so far i've got all my powders in here so i've got highlighters powders blushes bronzers but then there's some other ones that don't fit in uh then i have got my foundations concealers there's another little highlighter there glitters glitters single shadows lip products lipsticks beauty blenders and eyelashes so at the moment i've still got all of this <laughs> to go in so i'm a little bit stuck for ideas now <laughs>
again, they're just a little acrylic storage, but they've got like the little slats in between. So I've just got to oh, take, take the film off of them. show you I'm not 100% happy with how it looks but um, I've got a few ideas of how I can change that in the future but yeah other than that oh my god look at all my boxes in the corner here um, that is for a haul coming up very soon <laughs> um, yeah it's just boxes everywhere in this room um, so yeah no I'll show you what it looks like so it's nice and clear on the top, so I've just got a nice diffuser, a candle that my friend bought me. I have only burnt this like once or twice because I think it's such a beautiful candle um, that I'm reluctant to get rid of it. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to get over that fear and start burning it because it is beautiful and it smells amazing. And then I'm going to use it as a vase afterwards because it's just so pretty. Um, then obviously I've got my makeup mirror. So yeah, then I've just got some little oils. So these are actually from the salon that I work at. So I'm going to do a little video for them soon. So yeah, just orange and rose. They're really nice smelling. Then I've just got a little candle. This I picked up from the range. I've just popped my cotton pads in there. Um, I'm not too sure if I like it for that or not. Um, but there, it's fine like that for now. Then I've just got a cute little lamp there. And then... Over on this side, I've got my makeup brushes. So I don't normally like my makeup brushes out. I don't think they look very good. Um, this tray is just from the range. But yeah, I'm not I'm not feeling the brushes being out. But that'll do for now. They look clean and tidy. In here, I have literally just got all of my um, like costume jewellery, like chunky jewellery. Then in here... Um, I just popped my old palettes that I don't use very often, so if I take that off. And there's just a load of palettes that I don't use that often, so I thought that was quite a good way of hiding them out of my way. And then the one underneath, I have just put these little acrylic um, compartments, or these acrylic, whatever they're called, stands. Um, and I've just popped all the palettes that I use fairly often. So I've got my Naked Original palette, the Smoky palette, Morphe palette, my Huda Beauty Nude palette, Charlotte Tilbury um, Pillow Talk palette, Anastasia Beverly Hills Soft Glam palette, and then at the back there, that big one is the Carnival palette. Um, so I've just popped them like that. Again, they don't look great, but I'm thinking if I got some trunks in this room, um, you know, like the stacking trunks, then that could all go in there along with all my hair bits. Anyway, on to the main event. So 
this looks so much better than it did <laughs> so just on the side here i have put my morphe brow palette so i use that to do my eyebrows with and then i've also just popped um these little samples that i need to try that my rep sent me which is our brand new dermalogica active clay cleanser so i'm quite excited to try that so i've just popped that down the side until i've used it i then like i said i've started off with my highlighters then I've got a few powders there, blushes and then bronzers. And then in this bit here, I have got my primer and then my setting spray. And then there's another little primer at the back there. Then I've got another bronzer and I'm currently using this because I've ran out of my Laura Mercier setting powder. So um once lockdown's over and i can go out and get it or i might order it online i'm not too sure i'm just using this at the moment but that will probably go in the bin or <laughs> somewhere else once i have got my little i mean i could just slide it over and then laura mercy could sit in the in the middle there but yeah then i've got all my foundations and then that is another um highlighter there but sometimes it's quite nice to mix a couple of drops in this with your foundation if you're looking for a dewy glow so i've just popped that on my foundations then I've got my concealers. This is my ultimate favourite concealer. It's a Shape Tape by Tarte. So absolutely love the concealer. Um, then I've got all my lip treatments, really. Um, this is lovely. Obviously, it's wearing out now. It's the Espa Nourishing Lip Treatment. So it comes out like an oil, but it goes on like a lip gloss. So it keeps your lips nice and hydrated. Then I've just got some Ted Baker lip balms. The Prosecco one. I have then just popped in this drawer like your add-on bits like my tweezers, my pencil sharpeners, scissors, eyelash glue, bits and bobs like that. Then in the one at the back here is my glitters. So um, yeah, just got my glitters. Then I've got my eyelashes here. So I do need to pick up some more as well. So I've got room to pop more lashes in as well and then i've obviously got my lipsticks here well the ones i use regularly then i've got my beauty blenders and then this one in the back here well just this one here at the side i've got some obviously some eyelash curlers then i've got um mascaras a few other lip bits that i like um and lip liners basically and then i've got, got two single shadows there that i use quite regularly at the back, <laughs> tucked away, I've just popped that one at the back so if I get any more lipsticks that I use on a regular basis then they can come out and go in there. And then just in this little case here, oh, chucked it at the back because I don't really use it that often. So in here, it was hard to do one hand. I've just put like bits that I don't use very often so I've got single shadows in there, a few powders, lipsticks that I don't use that often, uh, a few more glitters there. So I just don't use that that often, so I've just chucked it at the back. Yes, yeah, so I've just popped it at the back there, so, you know, if I do want it, it's, it's, it's not that hard to get out. Um, where'd that come from? I'm ruining everything now. Yeah, so I've still got plenty of room to pop more lashes in and then um, back there. But because you can't open this drawer fully, so obviously when I've opened the drawer, that's as far out as it comes. But there is room for bits and bobs back there. But I just want to ease, I want easy, easy access to grab bits and bobs. So I've tried to do it as neat as I can. I'm quite happy with the drawer. Like I said, I'm just not overly keen on my brushes being there. But... So that is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, please make sure to give it a big thumbs up. If you'd like to see more videos like this of organisation and beauty bits and things like that, please make sure to hit the subscribe button. Thanks, guys. Bye.